These are the notes for section 8.3, combine like and unlike radicals. So combine like radicals, we're going to use the same method for like terms when combining variables and numbers. So for example, x plus 2x is 3x. If you notice the difference between this example and this example, all I've done was I've changed the variable x to a root x. So it's the same thing. Root x plus 2 root x would be 3 root x. So root 2 plus 2 root 2 would be 3 root 2. And then 10 root 5 minus 11 root 5 would be negative 1 root 5. Or you can write it as negative root 5. To combine unlike radicals, simplify each radical if possible, and you may get like radicals if so combined. In our first two examples, um, we have unlike terms here. So x plus y, you're used to. You would just write x plus y because I can't combine unlike terms. So in this example, root 2 plus root 3 is simply just root 2 plus root 3. In this example, I could not use this rule right here because neither one of these radicals can simplify. If you look at this example though, root 8 minus 3 root 2, we're going to simplify root 8 into root 4 and root 2 because there's a perfect square factor. So root 8 is going to become 2 root 2 and then I bring the rest of the problem over minus 3 root 2. So now root 8 turns into 2 root 2. Now I have like terms. I can combine the expression. 2 root 2 minus 3 root 2 is negative root 2. So there are some examples where it starts off with not like terms and it remains the same. Sometimes it looks like they're not like terms, but they actually are once you simplify. So my next example, root 48, I can simplify to... Um, root 16 and root 3 minus 4 root 3 equals, and then root 16 is 4, root 3 minus 4 root 3. Now I have my like terms, 4 root 3 minus 4 root 3 is equal to 0. In my last example, root 20 can be simplified. That can be broken up into 4 and 5. So this is rewritten, it would be root 5 plus 2 root 5 because the square root of 4 is 2 plus root 7. Now here I have two like terms in the, in the beginning but an unlike term here. So all I'm going to do is I'm just going to combine these two together. Root 5 plus 2 root 5 is 3 root 5 and then the root 7 I'm just going to write as plus root 7.